A shortage of nurses in the state could mean you won't see as many of them walking down the halls in Alabama hospitals. What could mean bad news for people who need nurses is good news for students at one local college who are working to go from the classroom to the emergency room. The more we hear and the more the, you know, the nursing shortages, it, the word gets out. Students realize that this is an opportunity for them to, to, to go to school and complete their education and then get a job. A job that nursing student Tina McGrath hopes to have when she graduates in December. But it's just, you know, it's good to know that you can go out there and take care of people when they need help and know that they're getting the right kind of care. Care that will be in demand in the coming years. Nationally, an estimated 340,000 registered nurses will be needed by the year 2020. An estimated 55 percent of current RNs anticipate retirement between now and 2020 as the nursing population ages and baby boomers begin to retire. Numbers that McGrath sees as an opportunity. It, but actually it benefits us because when we graduate then our chances of getting a job are pretty high. We're excited to be able to offer uh, the opportunity for students and, and because all of our health programs, not just nursing, have more applicants than we have seats available. So that allows us to be very, uh, we, we can choose the best student.